situation for my family is very tough and we all very afraid. Believe me, um, I hide my documents, education and, and work documents in, in an old stove and in, in garbage. Because if Taliban came and search my home, he couldn't find anything that, that I am an educated woman and I work for. I remember the worst part about leaving Afghanistan. The hardest part was as the plane took off. My heart broke for the country I was leaving behind. Women have been uh, told that they cannot return to work. Uh, or travel in public without being accompanied by a mahram and above the age of 12 uh, and grade 6 and above, gir uh, above girls are not allowed to go to school. I'm in touch with uh, our um, uh, Women for Women International program participants. Uh, they were so much uh, scared when uh, new the Taliban came uh, and uh, took control over Afghanistan. So right now, Women for Women is providing kitchen garden kits and poultry kits because that enables women to harness the power of food for themselves and their families, to be in control of the production of their food, not dependent on food aid or markets. But we also need the international community to release the absolutely critical funding that's needed for a wide scale, comprehensive response to the food crisis that's raging in Afghanistan. د چارباغ صفه د سنټر شاګر دی ما کله چې د نوې حکومت راغه ټول زونه بن شو مونږ ډیر خفه و کله چې بیرته دا سنټر شروع شو مونږ ډیر خوشحال شو دلته چې رازو یو بل ګورو او درس مزده کو خپل د کورنۍ اقتصاد سره of the world, the people live and have a piece of bread to eat for being alive. It is hurting for me and it's really hurt me. Why, why a world can see these people? Why world can, can listen to these people? 